When you think of the word cruel, what comes to mind? Pain, suffering, nastiness, some harm, or being unkind? I bet you don't think about the rights of that individual, instead you imagine only the literal harm they may feel. What about suffering? Where does that take your brain? Ongoing abuse and torture, but no rights involved again? It conjures up the idea of only unnecessary harm, and most think, I don't see it, though it's all okay on this farm. Don't even consider the mental or emotional trauma, so it's all fine to send them on to their humane slaughter. However, even if we could remove all of the above and give them lives of luxury, shower them with love, it wouldn't make it right. Even if that was your attitude, the exploitation remains, just the environment improves. That does nothing whatsoever to remove the rights violations. If anything, it buries them deeper under a welfare position. This isn't any more about farms though than it is about zoos. It's not just eating others that's the problem, but all of the use. Taking anything from someone who didn't get to choose, ignoring their freedoms when there's an option to refuse. It's not about their treatment, it's that it happens full stop. The exploitation of a rights bearer, whether it's cruel or not. So let's make some changes to the language that is used. Prioritise the rights violations over harm, suffering and abuse.